Hi guys, check it out. Dan Foglia. <laughs> One red gun. Okay, let's set that aside. Got a spare magazine. Just a box with uh, instruction manual. Some cleaning stuff. And the regular lock. There we go. See there, Tanfoglio Force Twenty Two L FT on the grip. Serial uh, serial number at the bottom. Um, over there, Defiant. And then up the Cal twenty two LR. Okay, so what this is it's just a polymer uh tanfoglio. It appears that the grip is the same as uh, the other uh, force, the defiant force models of, of tanfoglio, the the actual uh, frame or lower, and then it's got an aluminium or aluminum upper and it is in uh, 22 caliber controls is typical uh, CZ or Tanfoglio comes with two 10 round magazines and the spare mag has got a little red snap cap in so I'm assuming they don't want you to uh, dry fire this well it's not good to dry fire any 22 but or any rim fire but uh, some of the modern ones don't mind with that in there, and I can't find anything in the manual about it, uh, so I think it's a fair assumption uh, to make. 10 round magazine comes with two of them, uh, it's got serrations at the back, it's got these uh, lightning cuts up front, uh, steel sights, and hammer fired. That hammer looks like it's skeletonized, but it's just a, a silver detail that's uh, that's around it safety is real hard to go on but it comes off still like a very positive click on the off but it's a lot easier to get it off than it is to get it on which is okay because getting it off is uh, it's probably more important so Tanfoglio I'm guessing um, is aiming this gun at the sport shooting uh, guys, you know, Steel Challenge or uh, any one of the action sports. Also, maybe as a training, as a training gun. Um, I mean, it's a full-size pistol, and it's only 22. It is single action. Um, so when the hammer's down, it is single action. With uh, with that little snap cap in there, you can see uh, single action. The trigger is not great at all. Um, there's very limited info on this. I saw one video at the 2024 Shot Show, and the guys were saying, "Oh, it's got such a brilliant trigger. Uh, the trigger is gritty, very gritty." And uh, you can also see the if you pull the trigger, the hammer goes back, which is normal. Um, all hammer fired guns do that, but this one is just a lot, and it's real gritty. But I suppose it can be cleaned up. I'll show you in a minute on the inside where I think the problem is. Um, the trigger is got an over travel screw over there, and then if you look in there, the tip of my finger, that is a to take up the slack. And I haven't adjusted anything. This is out of the box. Uh, sights are steel, blacked out rear, but it's also got a black front, but it takes regular uh, tent foglio sights, so there would be no problem getting a fiber optic to uh, to go in there. That's really it, guys. There's nothing else to it. It's just plain CZ or CZ 75 tent foglio style pistol. 
mag uh, mag release is swappable, so you can swap it around to uh, you know between for left-handed use. Okay, taking it down is exactly like any other CZ or Tanfoglio. Take the uh, the magazine out, line up those two notches, press out the slide stop, pull that out, run the slide off the uh, off the front. We'll start with the frame. It's pure CZ or Tanfoglio, and I think the way. Tanfoglio pushes up this uh, the bar from the trigger to the to the sear. They use that little plunger over there, and um, that same plunger holds in the mag release. And I think that's where the grittiness sits. Because if I pull back on the on the hammer, I got a. You can actually hear it grind away, and I think that is grinding on the and then the slide. Recoil, uh, recoil rod and spring barrel. This is direct blowback, so there's no there's no cam. It's just the slide stop. Just uh, locates the whole thing, and it's just the weight of this that controls the the um, the lockup extractor. Does have a firing pin block. This is as light as can be. So Tanfoglio makes two of these, two models of, of these. This is the one. And then the other one they make, it's got a blue slide. It's exactly the same. It's just blue. But the barrel is a slightly longer, and it's threaded for a suppressor or a compensator. And it's got a, a thread-protecting cap on. And then that one also has a single double-action trigger, a very curved trigger, typically of a uh, Tanfoglio. And that's double single. This is just uh, single. Other than that, the, the two are exactly the same. Just out of interest, um, this is a regular Tanfoglio 9mm magazine. This one happens to be a Saj Malaz. And it clicks straight in there. Just confirming that the frame is exactly the same as the, the full size uh, center fire guns. That's it, guys. Very nice uh, pistol. I have not fired this yet. Um, I think we will function test it today and then try and smooth out that plunger on the bottom of the trigger and see if we can improve um, that. I like it. It fits my hand. It's kind of my, my style of pistol. Um, the only thing I don't really like about it is I don't like the blacked out front sight. That's easy to remedy and then I don't like that very gritty trigger. Um, but that too, I believe, can be remedied, and maybe I'll do another video at uh, at a later stage on uh, on the remedy um, of that. Hope you guys uh, found that interesting. Stay safe. We talk again. Cheers.